I am going to explain about Flutter using VHDL code. We know that the Flutter is a combinational circuit having three inputs ABC, uh, or else AB, and carry in. And coming to the outputs are I am taking here that is sum as well as carry. Carry. So this is the full adder and uh, coming to the designing process uh, Bison came up uh, we have done uh, the sum equal we know that that is a we can take if you take this one that is a bar b bar c plus and if you take second term that is a bar b c bar plus third term if you take that is a b bar c bar plus and uh, the last one this one is a b c all are ones a b c so this can be equivalent is this one a x r with b x r with c coming to the carry a b plus b c plus a c and uh, this is uh, the VHDL code s equal a x r with b x r with c and coming to this carry out uh, that is a and b a or c and a or c and b so this is about uh, full adder. Coming to the Xilinx code execution, and just open the Xilinx tool. Go to file, left side top corner, new project, give one name here, I am giving full adder. Any name you can give it here, no problem. So I have selected uh, preference long, preferred language VHDL, click on next, finish. And here go to left side like top corner, again right click, new source, select VHDL module, here I am giving ladder any name you can give it here no need to add dot v file full adder full adder click on next here we need to give the inputs capital a any either capital or uh, small letters you can give it a b c in i am giving carry in and uh, sum and carry out c outs are the outputs so here we can we need to change out so these three are inputs and uh, click on next finish and this is here we need to write our required code at the begin so here already it is there we, we can take it from here sum equal to axr with bxr with c in so uh, i'm taking from here yes so then Save it. Save it. Control S. Now we can go. We are going for implementation, and for that, uh, click on synthesize XST. In that, check syntax. It will take uh, 10 to 20 seconds time. So after that, we need to go for uh, view RTL schematic. So if yes, it is executed without any error successfully completed six syntax then view rtl schematic so here we will get this schematic diagram of our required full adder it will take uh, again some time yes here two, two options will get it any uh, with any option we can go no issue so click on add and create schematic for that yes this is the full adder abc and c out and some are the outputs if you want internal diagram double click on that and you can minimize you will get it now we need to go for simulation implementation part completed that is schematic part then go for simulation for that click on simulation then again right click new source select vhdl test bench Select VHDL test bench, full adder. 
to distinguish between them i am giving tb test bench flutter test bench click on next next finish so here so this is our uh, test bench code here i am going with direct inputs so that's why you can check it here carefully i am commenting this clock signal so i and here also clock is there i am commenting so no need to go with clock yes so now so this wait process is also not required this is also clock comment yes now all here only we need to give the inputs that is enough so a equal i am giving a equal zero and b equal b i am giving b equal zero and c equal zero c equal c n c n equal zero now we need to take that is eight operations are there eight times we want so that's why copy second time enter third time fourth time fifth time sixth time seventh time now we need to change the inputs that is enough uh, first time 0 0 0 second time 0 0 1 third time 0 1 0 fourth time 0 1 1 0 1 1 I am changing next fifth time 1 0 0 and uh, next 1 0 1 next 1 1 0 next 1 1 1 1 1 so all the inputs i have given all the possible inputs now we can save it this one control s yes so then click on the test bench so then here click on this isim simulator again check syntax behavioral syntax yes it is executed so then go for simulate behavioral model it will take some time yes this is our required output uh, after this just click on this zoom to full view click on that you will get it our required then minus so we can see this 0 0 0 inputs sum is 0 carry is 0 so like this we will get it uh, our required uh, full order circuit thank you if you have any doubts you can send me